Off. We're at a place called Dry Case. It's a CES show, so this is a brand new product. What you have here, it's uh, completely waterproof. We've had someone scuba dive down to 100 feet with it. We have a patented vacuum seal. You can use a digital camera, cell phone, anything that fits in here. I use my iPhone because I have my music, and I can swim with it and listen to my music at the same time. So I hook up the headphone jack. It comes out right there. We also sell waterproof headphones. That They'll go down to about 10 feet until the pressure doesn't allow them to vibrate and emit uh, sound anymore. So you clip it in, spin it, and then it comes with this neoprene armband and also this, uh, this bulb. But if you lose the bulb, you can just use your mouth, put it on there, take out the air. It's all, it was already waterproof, now it's vacuum sealed. And the great thing about the vacuum seal, it's completely, completely functional. You can take pictures with it. And then we also have it in the larger size for iPads, Kindles, any tablet, or anything else you want to fit in here. So this will run down to a depth of uh, basically 100 some feet? Well, someone took the iPhone down to 100 feet. Um, it could go further, we don't know. It's just it pretty much the dry case is going to hold it as long as the phone doesn't break. The uh, kind of interesting thing is the idea of the vacuum on here so the capacitive screen works very easily through uh, less than one millimeter, which it is. But one of the most important things about this, since it's going to be used for a project, is this plug right here. The plug then is actually a plug that allows you to control the outside world to what's in here. They have an earphone jack, but you can think of it as some kind of external plug. They make with data, GPS, a number of other things from an external source into it. You guys really have a great product. On, on this iPad case, can you give me the approximate price of one of these? Absolutely. We uh, re retail these for $59.99, and for the smaller ones, they go $39.99. The headphones, $29.99. This, I think, solves one of our main problems for a major project we're going to have. So awesome. thank you very much, John. Absolutely. Edwin, here is an overview of the dry case that uh, is on the previous video. It has the strap, most importantly, the vacuum bulb. Here is a case then that will allow the iPad to uh, remain operative down to a depth of 100 feet, mainly because it has a capacitive uh, display onto a touch screen. Resistive will also work, but the key here is a vacuum controlled by the bulb. The other and most important thing for us is the fact that they do have a sealed connector. This connector just happens to be a four pin connector which would be good for audio or video. It's a conventional connector. I'm going to work with a manufacturer and convert this around to a waterproof four pin connector which will be USB or eight pin connector then which will give us additional ports then. So we can attach other cables to this, waterproof cables, which will go to the surface. I also am working with a manufacturer to have USB modular devices that will fit in here. This will extend our USB cable connection length to well over 100 feet, which is the depth of the bag. I see an incredible application of this in a lot of the stuff we're doing for scientific underwater data gathering. I don't see this application for the iPad or the Android, mainly because these are simple applications. And to do anything scientific, we need to actually put in equipment. We need to monitor scientific data, uh, temperature, various other parameters, pH, dissolved oxygen, and we can only do that if we have the drivers for the device. While applications are neat, lacking the drivers in an iPad or an Android operating system makes the application of this rather limited, even though we can do DR. So anyway, something to think of from CES 2011, Las Vegas, Nevada.